Now Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, On the day of judgment, there is going to be a statement between Allah, the maker, and between this messenger, Jesus. Allah says, وَإِذْ قَالَ اللَّهُ يَا عِيسَ بْنَ مَرْيَمْ أَأَنْتَ قُلْتَ لِلنَّاسِ اتَّخِذُونِي وَأُمِّيَ إِلَهَيْنِ مِن دُونِ اللَّهِ Allah says, we will ask Jesus Christ, may peace be upon him on the day of judgment. So, Jesus may peace be upon him. Allah says, we will ask him, oh Jesus, did you tell the people to worship yourself and your mother besides the maker and the creator, besides me who made you? And Jesus is going to answer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Subhanak ma yakunu li an aqula ma laysa li bihaqqa. Glory be to you, O my Maker, all high. It is impossible for me to utter any word besides that which you instructed me to utter. I did not tell them that. I didn't tell them to worship myself, to worship my mother. Had I said it, O Allah, you would have known it. You know everything about me. You know what is hidden in me. I do not have that knowledge which you possess, Ya Allah. You know the unseen completely. Then he continues to say, I only told them what you instructed to tell me to tell them and that is worship Allah who made me and who made you. Worship the one who made me and who made you. That is the one you will call him the worshipped one. In the Hebrew language they use the term Eloha or Elohim to refer to Allah which means the worshipped one. Subhanallah. Then he says, I did not utter anything besides which you, that which you told me to say to them, that worship Allah, Rabbi wa Rabbakum. إِنَّهُ مَنْ يُشْرِكْ بِاللَّهِ فَقَدْ حَرَّمَ اللَّهُ عَلَيْهِ الْجَنَّةَ وَمَأْوَاهُ النَّارِ In another verse, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Jesus said, Whoever associates partnership with the Maker will definitely end up in hellfire and will lose the heaven. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala safeguard us. Then he says, إِن تُعَذِّبْهُمْ فَإِنَّهُمْ عِبَادُكُ Oh Allah, if you want to punish them, they are your worshippers. You have that, you own that. Allah made, He can do what He wants. So He's saying, Ya Allah, if you want to punish them, they are your worshippers. وَإِن تَغْفِرْ لَهُمْ فَإِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْعَزِيزُ الْحَكِيمُ and if you want to forgive them, Ya Allah, if you forgive them, you are indeed all powerful, all wise, you know. Allah is the one whom He knows He can punish, but over and above that He still forgives. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us.